Good morning to everybody. It is time for the Monday Lot Walk and we got Tommy again. What's Good up, morning. Tommy? Good morning, Q2. How are you guys doing today? We're, uh, well. It's a little chilly out. It's, we got the vests again and the sweatshirts. Um, it is October 16th, 2023 and we got a slew of vehicles in. And Tommy, what's the theme for today? Trucks, trucks, and trucks. We got trucks. We got a lot of trucks. Uh, especially heavy duty trucks. We got a lot of those. Um, little upset, one of my guys took one of the cool half tons that we just got in. Tommy, did you see that uh, Ram Laramie 1500 with the blue, with the blue wheels and everything oh, last week? Oh, that thing week? was gorgeous. Oh, that thing's crazy. That so we got like a 2019 Laramie Level 1 uh, and blue streak metallic. It's got some really cool wheels on it. My cleanup guy took it already, so we're not going to see that. Anyways, <laughs> uh, as always, all these vehicles are linked in the description below. Uh, with full descriptions and they'll get, be getting pictures later today uh, down a couple guys in detail so if not today tomorrow for sure and we're going to go over everything that we didn't get to last week in the uh, well, lot walk because they came in after lot walk so let's get right to it and uh, uh, if you want to know anything about these vehicles call Tommy he's the guy right there feel free to reach Tommy out Tommy at summitauto.com is his email so check that out all right Tommy this just came in. They didn't even have a packet made for this one yet. This is a uh, 2007, no, 2000, yeah, 2017 Chevy 2500. It's a double cab work truck. Uh, but what I like about GM and what they've done to these work trucks is they've put 20 inch polished aluminum wheels on them. So they look, you know, they've got a little bit of uh, flair to them, even though they're just a work truck. Look how, look how clean this truck came in. This one's got, uh, 57,000 miles or 51,000 miles. This is exactly how it came in. We didn't touch this one yet. Isn't that crazy? I mean, the way it is, it's sits and clean. You'd be it's ready to, to go. You'd be ready to put this one in somebody's driveway today. <laughs> so we do get really, this clean. It's crazy. Really nice truck. Uh, red hot is the color on that one. And uh, like I said, 51,000 miles, 2017. It's got the six liter gas engine in it. Platinum. F-250, this is also a 2017. And Tommy, what's the color on this one? This one is referred to the white gold. White gold. You don't see this one often. Right? That's a, a very, touch. yeah, I think they only had this color one or two years. Um, usually you see it in a two-tone with the brown on the bottom, but this one is full white gold. And it's a platinum, and this thing's all loaded up. Of course, it's got the power the step bars, uh, the two-tone seats. It uh, has the panel roof, the navigation system, and just really, really a nice truck. Um, and it's the 6.2 liter gas. So uh, if you don't need the diesel power, you know, th this is a nice truck. FX4, all loaded up, really clean. Uh, so we're going to be getting that rolling today. Hopefully pictures by the end of the day. This one's nice too. Yeah, this is a. I saw this one come in. This is a 2018 Chevy 2500 High Country. Um, really nice condition. It has 46,000 miles. Oh, this Platinum has 22,000 miles. Extremely low miles. This one's got a lift on it. We're probably going to be doing tires to it. That one's locked up because I already got this one booked in. Uh, really clean on the inside. Really clean on the outside. Tommy, what do you what do you think we sell the most of here? Trucks. Trucks? Fords, yeah. Rams, Chevys, Dodge, GMCs. I mean, uh, we have all of them, anything you can think about. A lot of 2500s I've noticed. We, we kind of specialize in the heavy duty trucks. Um, this is another 2019 F250 XLT. It's got the 6.2 liter gas. It's kind of more of a work truck. You see it's got a really nice ladder rack on it. And uh, that'd be for like a roofer or something. And um, you know, you can of... always take those off if you don't need them. Absolutely. Underneath that, it's a really nice truck. Uh, probably going to be doing tires on that one. This is uh, one of our lone SUVs we got today. This is a 2018 Expedition Max. Limited. Limited. This one also has the Max tow package. So this one can tow up to like 9,000 pounds. Impressive. So, um, Anybody don't quote looking? me exactly on that number because it might be a little bit less but i know i was looking at one of these last year to pull my camper and my camper is 8200 pounds and one of these would tow it so um really nice condition magnetic grays the color uh we're going to be getting that rolling today as well over here we've got a lariat tremor 
This is a Power Stroke Diesel, and I swear all the tremors always have some sort of problem. So this one's got a little dent in the front. <laughs> We're probably gonna have to be doing a bumper on that one, but um, other than that, it's white platinum tri-coat, and this one has 25,000 miles on it. Really nice condition other than that bumper. Oh yeah, this uh, Expedition Max has 74,000 miles. You're probably gonna get some leads on this one, Tommy. I can imagine. Sure. This is our trade-in of the weekend right here. This is a 2017 Jeep Cherokee Latitude Plus. Uh, it's a four x four and it's got 83,000 miles on it. Really nice condition. I believe it was purchased here new yep. and traded in. Did you take this one in? Jesse took it in on trade. They Jesse traded did? in for a 23 grand Cherokee. Really? They upgraded to a whole size bigger. So they moved up to the full size. Absolutely. Yeah, really nice vehicle. All it's gonna need is tires, I think. Other than that, it's pretty much She's mint. Good to go. Yeah, they kept really, really, really good records and kept so, the upkeep pretty well. This is a 2021 Ram 2500 Bighorn Level 1 Night Edition. This truck has 46,000 miles on it. Now, is this one a diesel? Yeah, this one's a diesel. Cummins. Look at, look at some of the silly stuff that people do. <laughs> I'm like, why would you do that? <laughs> I get it. They look neat. Look at those tires, BFGs. Oh, like gosh. Brand new tread. On. Yeah, it looks really good. So Tommy, how long have you been selling cars? I've been selling cars for five years. I've been here for uh, two years. Where'd so you? I've been doing this for a while now. Where, where were you selling before? Bergstrom Automotive in uh, Bergstrom? Oshkosh. Yep. Okay. Then uh, Yeah, kind of a big conglomeration there, huh? Yeah. I mean, that's since I made the transition, the inventory here has been wonderful. Uh, during consistent. COVID. Consistent, yeah. That was one thing that was tough uh, back then is during COVID, you couldn't get that. So uh, yeah, came here ever since and it's been wonderful here. Awesome. Well, we're glad to have you on board. This is a 2022 GMC 3500 AT4 single rear wheel. This is a diesel. This is the Duramax. And this is a really nice truck. 23,000 miles. Oh my goodness. AT4s are pretty sought out, man. The aggressive look on it, the beautiful front end. Yeah. The red tow hooks to complement the vehicle. It's a nice sporty vehicle. I think every time we get one of these in, that's sold pretty oh, it much. Flies instantly. Pretty much as soon as we get a price on it, it's gone. But really nice truck, really nice condition. We're gonna have to detail it a little bit, but uh, really nice condition otherwise. And this is a Ram 2500 Bighorn Night Edition. This is a gasser, 2022, and this one has 19,000 miles on it. I haven't even looked at this one yet. This one's pretty nice shape. Has the cargo cam, the LED tail lamps. Just a really nice ride. Yeah, 19,000 miles on that one. This one, we just got through the shop. How's it look? I think it's gorgeous. We just got it through our Super detail clean. process. I'll be getting a video of this one later today other than this video. Really nice condition. I think we did tires on this one. Took a little bit to get it ready, but she's really nice. What year is this one? This is a 2020, I want to say. Mm. And they got it all locked up. I don't know offhand. This it's not on my one. list. This is a nice <laughs> one though. Uh, here's another GMC 3500. Uh, this is a little bit different than the other one. This one here is a 2018. So you can see the difference in the body style. Uh, from 2022 to 2018. I think they switched body styles in 2020. So that's the new body style, that's the old body style. This is an SLT and it's got 57,000 miles on it. Um, pretty nice truck and we'll get that one Good rolling job. too. And I also wanted to go over all the stuff that uh, we didn't get to last week, which we're gonna start off right here with this King Ranch. This thing's hot. We already had a price request on this. This is a King Ranch Power Stroke. It's a King Ranch Ultimate. So you get Tremor. the nav, the pano, and it's also a Tremor Edition. So you get the two inch lift from the factory. Those rims though, God, yeah, that's good. Doesn't that look good? The gold wheels on there. Just accents the lower two paint tone, there. Absolutely. Really hot truck. This is a 2021 and it's got 39,000 miles on it. Just about to go into service right now. Uh, and then we got this one right here. This is a 2022 XL. This is a really nice work truck for somebody. Oxford white. It's got 42,000 miles on it. 
We're probably gonna do tires on it. Other than that, it's really clean all the way around. Really a nice truck. I mean, it's just a work truck, so not too much to talk about on they that They are one. definitely in high demand. Let's see, what we get. We had a Pacifica here. That one's already, Austin already took that one. So that one will be sold. That was a like a 21 Pacifica with 33,000 miles on it. Luxury white pearl coat. You never see that color. Mm. Too bad they took it already. We got a couple others. That's one I just did a video on. Jose buffed that one. Look at how nice that one looks. Yeah, Jose does do an awesome job with everything we get. Just like a brand new truck here. Uh, so let's see what else we got. He's our main guy. The Look at this. Machine. This is a 2018 Tommy. This one came in last week. Big this is horn. a Cummins diesel big horn 4x4 off road. This one's from California. Oh, wow. That's, it's got 33,000 miles so on it. That's Just the nice thing is we get vehicles from all over the country. Everywhere. It's crazy. You got them. Um, I started putting uh, where they're from in the titles of my descriptions on the videos. Just see if that helps people relate. I do like it. It's so these are all the ones we've already covered. This is a 2017 XLT uh, crew cab. It's got the 6.2 liter. Uh, we're probably going to be taking that cap off. It's not the right color. I see that. It's and it's not the right size. That. If you look, it, it's a little bit it must be front. must be for an F-150 or something because it's about two inches. <laughs> they like <laughs> they like cut it well there. Well played. <laughs> so, anyway, other than that, though, this truck's hot. It's got some really nice wheels and tires on it, and you know, being a gasser, that'll be a nice price point for somebody that needs a heavy-duty truck. This one right here is a 2021. Lariat with 32,000 miles on it. Iconic silver is the color. Iconic silver. They changed it from uh, ingot silver to iconic silver in 2021. So this is the first year of this color. Uh, Lariat, really like those on there. Michelin tires, Absolutely. really nice truck. Yeah. Well dressed. I'm gonna have to do some Great editing work. on this video, Tommy. It's too long. <laughs> My phone just told me the, the video is too long. Uh, what else we'll we got? The Honda, uh, this one, the Honda over there, that's everybody's Sienna. been hot on this Escape. And then this Toyota Sienna came in last week. That's going to be a hot vehicle. Absolutely. Finally, we got this Honda Ridgeline Sport, 30,000 miles on it. That's going to be a really nice vehicle, too. 21 or 22, I think it was. Uh, this is a 2021. 21. Pretty much mint. Yeah. There's one little ding on the door that we got to fix. But other than that, this thing came in really clean. One owner, clean title history. Yep. Two sets of keys, all good. Jesse took that one in on trade. Yeah, and we'll probably be doing uh, Jesse next week or one of the other guys for the lot walk. That's pretty much it. And once again, Tommy, what's the theme here? Trucks, trucks, and trucks. We got we trucks. Got, em. got a me. lot of trucks. Just want to thank Tommy for helping with the lot walk today. Uh, summitauto.com, all of our inventory is there. All the vehicles in the video are in the description below. Like I said, give Tommy a call. Thank you for having He's me. He's your guy. We'll get them rolling. Thanks, Tommy. Have a great day, everybody. Let's keep it rolling in October. Take it easy.